Yo! Moon squats tonight. Back from vacation. Long day of work. Squats, bitch. <laughs> As I was doing these, and I was filming myself do a few sets here, show the depth, ass to grass, bitches. So it reminded me of a uh, video that I posted and why I'm making this video right now, because all I'm doing tonight is squats. I'm just squatting. Adeline, it's 8.05. Adeline's done gymnastics at 8.30. And I started at about 7.20, so I had an hour and 10 minutes to work out. And I was like, fucking squats, bitch. You're gonna get a workout. Functional, fuckable, ignorant. Squat till you puke. Squat till your fucking legs give out. Don't be a pussy. That's why I'm doing it. But the reason I'm making this video. Last time I posted on Instagram, a guy made a comment. A younger man, probably you know, like a child type deal. Said, it's junk volume. It's shit. It's fucking pointless. You know what? He's right. There's no fucking reason from a bodybuilding standpoint to do 25 sets of 225 at 10, 10 reps a set. No fucking point. It's stupid, really. You're fatiguing the muscle. You're really not getting anything beneficial out of it. Are you? Now, some can argue that, yeah, you will at some point. Now, let's leave the science out of this because some of you fucking dipshits put too much science into all this. I am not doing any of this to promote growth from a you know, legs looking big and juicy. No, this is just to make sure that I'm a little bit less of a fucking pussy today. It's all it is. It's why I do this. Because I continually put myself under the bar over and over. Fucking bar digging into the back more and more. I'm fucking 17 sets in. Bitch, I got fucking, I'd like to get 10 more before this night ends. A little bit less of a pussy today than I was. That's the goal. It is junk volume. You're fatiguing the muscle. You're not even pushing the failure, you're just draining it of everything. It's because I'm not doing it for physical appearance from a bodybuilding standpoint. I'm doing it for this fucking thing, for inside here. Because the world needs more motherfuckers. It needs more of us. It needs more people that are willing to do hard shit over and over and over and over again. And less people that bitch complain and chase nothingness. Because in life, you're gonna need to be able to stand up and do some pretty wild shit, some hard shit, even when you don't want to. And whenever you have one hell of a fucking stressful day, longer than you anticipated, more bumps in it than you anticipated, obstacles or just conversations you didn't really want, this turns into a release. You can take it out of aggression. You can put on a soundtrack and let that bitch rip and just do fucking squats until you can't squat no more. Because during that time, you're gonna find yourself. You're going to forget about all the bullshit throughout the day. You're going to realize that what you're doing right now kind of sucks, but you're getting enjoyment out of it. And you're starting to reconnect and put yourself back together before you go home to your family. Because after a really hard day, I don't wanna go home and have a fucking drink and then see my family. No, I'd rather, I'd rather get my shit together in here and then go see my family without any inebriation, without any anger or any fucking pent up aggression or violence in me. It is junk volume, kid. It's shit. But I ain't doing it to look good. Doing it for here, doing it for here. Be a little bit less of a pussy today. That's why. And for everybody that wanted a little addition to it, mental health, that's why. Make sure you're cool. Push yourself, challenge yourself. Make yourself go so far at this that the physical part, like your legs shaking and you start to get upset. Yeah, that's good. You start to get so mad at the day and you're just letting it all pour out. Let it all out. Challenge yourself physically, mentally, 
emotionally. That's when you start tapping into yourself, that spiritual aspect of life. And you got to it just by those four plates in that fucking bar right there. At least that's what's done for me. Let's do more squats. Do a good job. Don't be a pussy. Also, remember this, if you don't think you can take one fucking leg workout and make it this, you're full of it. Take one and just do squats the whole fucking time. The whole time. An hour and a half of just fucking squats. You'll thank me later.
That's it. It's a wrap. I lost fucking count. Madeline just came in. She's done. So I'm gonna get changed. Head out. Again. It's junk volume. Kid, you're right. It is. Shit. But sometimes it ain't all about how you look. It's about what you got. And everybody. You need to take at least at least one leg workout every six eight weeks just do fucking squats be a little bit less of a pussy because we all know it we all got it in us we all search for the easy road when we say we're going to train to failure oh it started getting hard it's the shit that separates us it's also the shit that makes you feel alive. It's like I said, honest to God's truth, I feel different an hour and 10 minutes later. An hour and 10 minutes ago, I felt like a different person than I do right now. I love it. I personally found out that I like, like hard, intense, aggressive things. I mean, I guess that's why I constantly talk to you guys the way I do, like, no, don't be a pussy. You know, that's how I talk to myself. It's not that I'm saying that to you so that you're like, you know, I'm saying it to you because this type of mentality has worked for me in my life, not just in the gym, but my entire life. And whenever people want to search for the inches on how to get better in life, it's not that you need to do everything just like me. It's not it. You don't got to be 50% vegan. You don't got to be fucking 25% CrossFitter, 15% natural and all that happy horse shit. If you can take parts from my training, my philosophies, my mentality, and add them to your own, mix it with other people that you follow or feel connected with as well to make your life better for your people, your children, your significant other, your business, your coworkers. It's all I want, dude. You can take all the money in the world. It doesn't add up enough to who you are, to your family, and your community. Because if you're a good motherfucker, good things will come. If you're a hardworking good motherfucker, money will come. You will be a fucking magnet for the good shit. Living proof of it. Didn't always have all this shit. So, do more squats. Eat meat, eat good fruits, quality foods, and of course, your action sled supplements, motherfuckers. Have a good day.